Good morning, everybody. <coughs> Cab looks really, really good this morning. I'm happy. I'm happy with it. I'm going to let that set, though, because after spraying yesterday, I realize I have got to get my exhaust set up. I knew I had to, it's just I haven't had time. So today I am going to work on getting my filter system set up. I have to. I wanted to get some stuff done and start on that right there today, but I've got a lot of parts and a lot of spraying that I'm going to be doing, so I have got to get my exhaust set up. I've been kind of putting it off, but I knew I needed to do it. All right, I'm going to get a couple things moved around here. I'm going to see if I can fire this thing up, get it moved because I need it in this corner. Yeah. I'm going to try to get some gas in there, even though it ain't got the fuel filler hooked up. I don't know. I might, I can't remember where I was on that fuel filler. If I can get it hooked up, I'll, I'll just hook it up, dump some fuel in it. Cause I know it's out of gas. I did get it fired up after I moved in here. Just had to dump gas in a carburetor and it ran until it, ran out so i know it's out of fuel if i can get some fuel in it then i'll move that thing around and uh see if i can get a paint booth filter system set up all right let me get set up here this morning Dad came in last night. We was discussing the paint filter situation and he had an excellent idea. So, Cycle a couple of hours. Now I'll take that over there. It's got a little weight to it.
Awesome. Awesome sauce. I guess I'm gonna have to get Rob in here to look at it. Alright, let's see what we got here. The filters are 38 inches. This is 43. Okay. So I need to build a frame. Straighten that up. I need to build a frame around this. Let's see. How tall is this? <laughs> all right guys if you all remember the 56 nomad i did which by the way that car is for sale if anybody's interested get a hold of me he brought this expanded over to me and uh I think that'll be a good fit for the back to support the filters from being sucked in. I found these angles in the corner. I am going to make a frame, put that expanded on it, and that'll hold the filters. I'm going to put some sort of a clamp on top to clamp the filter tight and i don't know we'll see how it goes on the rest of it how it's going to be held on there but i'm going to play it by ear and just build it i'm going to put a brace across here stiffen this up and my paint booth built uh, fan that i bought a couple years ago is going to go on top of that right in the center it's a little bit bigger so I'm gonna have to cut the back out and tube it out no big deal I'm gonna put it in this corner diagonally I'm gonna come out of the top of the cabinet go up over and out where the old hanging furnace was
Well, I think I got a plan. Filters will set down in there. I'm gonna put little hangers off of this to stab the filter on because it's soft, you know. I'll just lay it up in there, stab it through, and that'll hold it in place. That's better than what I had at the old shop. They kept falling down over there. I probably just have hangers on the top side. Put hangers on the top side. And then, I don't know, I'll, I'll see what I have to do at that point. Uh, now I gotta pop this back out and get everything stitched in. I wanted this removable, that way I can get inside and clean if I need to. Get this out of the way and uh, start welding.
Close enough. Alright. 
Now, I need something to hold that. <clears throat> and I need a new motor. Apparently, the motor's bad. Took that motor off there and put another one on, and it does the same thing. The fan spins freely. It just will not run. I don't know what's going on. I've never had problems with it. Uh, I don't see any grease zerks anywhere. I don't know, I'll have to uh, mess with that. But as for today, I'm going to go get the crew cab, bring it back in. And I think I'm a done for today. It took a bit longer than what I was expecting, but I think that'll work out just fine. And instead of putting the intake filters there, I'm going to put intake filters over here somewhere. That way it draws across. Now I put my fan on top of that and then tube up to there. It'll be good. <clears throat> that was a really good idea that dad had using that cabinet. I had to go around and caulk all the seams on it. I, I caulked all of them on the outside and most of them on the inside. I think that'll work out just fine as frog hair. Once I get my fan fixed. Yeah, I like it. All right, guys, I'm gonna get out of here. I got this thing back in here. <laughs> Orange dust on it from my hands. Hey. Who's leaving black marks? Surely this thing don't run. Well, all be dead. Check it out. Man. If I can ever quit working on the building and get back on the customer cars, I might be able to work on something like this. <sighs> Agitating, but it's all gotta be done. Uh, this video is Friday night. I don't know what's going on uh, this weekend. I think I've got a customer coming in uh, Saturday afternoon, evening time to bring some parts. I'm not sure. I, I have to get back with him on that, but I don't know. If the weather's decent, I might have something a little different for a video come Monday. Either way, I'm taking the weekend off. If, uh, if my customer does come in with the parts, I'll come in for that, but I'm, I'm not gonna work. I'm getting worn out. I need a break for a minute. I wanna get, uh, 
that dart started next week. See where I can get on that. I want to continue with the 72 uh, with the parts that I do have for it. Some parts are still on order, some are back ordered. I've got some, so I've got plenty of work to do. We were supposed to have storms yesterday, today, and the next, I think, 10, 11 days, something like that. Well, yesterday was absolutely gorgeous. It was cloudy most of the day, sunshine here and there, cooler. Today, it got a little bit warmer, full sun. I don't know where the glass guy is. He's got to replace that one window that they cracked before they left. Finish that one window on top and they'll be done. <sighs> but for right now, I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to go get me a burger. I like hamburger. It's the only meat worth eating. I like steak, but hamburger is my go-to. Alright guys, I'm going to get off here and go home. You have a blessed evening.